Hello, Sag. I am here to do your April bi weekly. See what's going on for you guys for the second half of April. What is up? What is up with my Sagis? Um, the song I got on shuffle for you guys is Mercy by Shawn Mendes. You got a hold of me. Don't even know your power. Do you have it bad for someone or does somebody have it bad for you? I feel like you guys might have it bad for someone and you're just kind of wanting some clarity from this person. You want this person to like give you some kind of clarity or there's somebody that's wanting this from you, Sag. So keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. Let's see. Let's see what the overall energy between you and another person for the second half of April is. Five of Cups. Five of Cups. Hmm, crying over spilled milk, are we? Wishing there were things you could do differently. This could be you or the other person or the both of you. Wishing you could have done things differently. Focused on the cups that are spilled instead of what is like, you know, still, still good. Um, hmm. I feel like you're going to get a communication here soon. Um... Things didn't turn out the way you wanted them to. You wanted things to turn out a certain way, and they didn't. Um, you are going to get communication. I feel like you're going to get another opportunity to make things right. Um, could be travel involved, but I feel like you kind of have to let go of that energy of thinking you could have done things differently because the things that happen happen the way that they happen. So... You got to move forward. You got to move forward fast. So let's see what the individual energies are. King of Cups could be dealing with a water sign. And the Emperor. The Emperor's here. In reverse, somebody is a little bit in their ego. That might be you, Sag. You might be the one in your ego. You could be dealing with an Aries, though. Um, why is the Emperor in reverse here? Somebody's offering you their love. You're kind of not seeing it. You got the Hermit in reverse here. So you're not like, you, you're kind of in a negative headspace. You're feeling rejected, I feel like maybe. You're feeling like, but this person's offering to you, but you're just not seeing it. You're not seeing it. Um, I feel like this person's going to make, is trying to make a decision toward, has made a decision, wants to offer you love. I feel like you're not, you're not seeing, you're not very stable right now. You're kind of, you're in a wounded phase. But I feel like this person's coming through offering you something. Why do I feel like that? I feel like they, it took them a while, but they made a decision. They're taking responsibility for their actions. I feel like you're going to get communication soon, Sag. Yeah, this person's been cold to you. I feel like they're not going to be. They had to like heal some stuff. Um, yeah, there's the Five of Pentacles in reverse. This person's coming out of the no communication. Um, you've been a little bit blocked. Maybe they felt a little bit, you've like blocked them a little bit, maybe. Maybe not physically, but energetically. You've been trying to just kind of heal. Um, but it looks like this person wants to come forward and offer you their cup of emotions. They had to balance themselves. They had to make a decision. They had to release their past in order to realize that like you are wish fulfillment. You are gonna get communication soon, Sag. It seems like the theme for today is communication because a lot of people are getting communication today. Um, even myself, I've gotten some, I've had like delays on communications with certain people and they have finally come through. Um, but I feel like there's one person that you guys are waiting. you waiting. There's the victory card. You're going to have victory in this situation, Sag. You are going to have victory in this situation. The Knight of Pentacles, they're just coming slow. Could be dealing with an earth sign. I feel like you guys are both moving really slow. You could be dealing with a Virgo, obviously. Libra's here. But there's a lot of major arcanas. So I feel like there's just been an imbalance. There's been, this has been all part of a spiritual journey. Part of a lesson you have to learn. I feel like you need to learn the lesson. This person's coming forward. This person needed time to make a decision. They've made a decision. You've been really shut off and like not in a good way. I feel like you've been taking this too personally when it's nothing to do with you and everything to do with this person. So there they are coming to you with the Knave of Cups. You have the Two of Cups here. 
So they could be offering you this new relationship. They could have needed time to think about it. What is this Knave of Wands offering? Coming in with a message for sure. The world, they don't want this to be over with you. I don't think they want this cycle to be over. They're not ready for to close this chapter. I think maybe they want to have some kind of rebirth with you, especially with the Two of Cups here. Give me a... Yeah, whatever they are coming in, offering, it's going to get you out of this like Four of Cups mode. You're going to be out of the depression. It's going to lift you from this depression. So uh, hang in there tight, Sag, because I feel like you do have... Let me clarify this Eight of Wands just to see. Yeah, I feel like whatever this communication is, it's going to um, relieve you from whatever confusion you've been in. This person's been like struggling. This person's been struggling, but they've had a stroke of luck. Um, something has shifted them forward. The universe has been guiding them. They're going to come to you. They've made a decision. They're going to offer you. Some form of love, some form of emotion. They're coming to you as a king, so they mean business. If you've been in no communication, that's going to end soon. So just hang in there tight. You do have victory with this situation. You do have the Two of Cups. This is a soulmate relationship, and it has been very divinely guided. So if you've been going through a rough time, it seems to be that the universe wanted it to be that way. So, Sag, that is what I'm seeing for you guys. Pretty quick reading here, but if you want to check out the extended, um, I will be doing messages from this person, actions this person is going to take towards you, advice from your spirit guides, as well as what is blocking this connection. So, obviously, the gist is if you've been waiting for someone to communicate to you, looks like they are going to communicate, and they're coming in you know, with a pretty good offer, I feel like. So, so fret not. Just get out of that ego. Get out of your ego because I think you're taking things way too personally that you shouldn't be. So that's what I'm seeing for you guys, Sag. Um, I will see you in the extended. And yeah, have a great week. Bye.